All right, we are starting the fourth round. We're two and one right now. Two place we're in. Forty sixth place. Woo! We're climbing up the ranks. Who do we not want to play against? I don't actually know. I think this is um, Autumn Burchett. I wouldn't want to play against them. Don't want to play against Max Attack or Cherry X Man. This guy, Cherry X Man, is probably on Eldrazi Tron with Once Upon a Time, which is pr pr good deck. But I don't want to play against Lapless Jan. There's a lot of freaking grinders here today. I mean, they're, they're, oh, there's our old opponent, 2 1. So our first round opponent lost to somebody. They're 2 1, just like us. Stupid man, you little Titan. Stupid main board, Bajuka Bog. Man. Amulet of the Titan is such a good deck. It's probably the best deck. And Eldrazi Tron is probably one of the other best decks. Yeah. <clears throat> Anything with Once Upon a Time is a best deck. All right. Hopefully we get to be on the play. Hopefully we get good draws. Good luck. All right. We're not on the play. Oh, man. This is so risky. On the draw, though, in the blind. This hand is insane if I top deck a land. I have two draws, and they mulligan. Fuck it. Table down to five, sure. <clears throat> I'm not going to F6 in case they have Dotsies. Hope it's not Neoform or anything. All right, Forest, Stirrings, maybe it's Tron. Or Amy the Titan. It's Tron. Sweet. They missed, they missed a Tron land. So... This is good. Um, I'm gonna mill myself here. <clears throat> the reason being, if I hit a Vengevine, which I have, and I hit a land next round, next turn, I can go Heatran Crab into land, mill myself, and do stuff. Scrying, they played the mine. Okay, they have a plant hand. Land, 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 land. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. That was me smacking myself. God damn it. Fuck, 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 fuck. Look at this insane hand! God damn it, no! We're so close! Just to land. And look, we haven't even milled. We've only milled a single land. We've milled one land. We haven't even fetched. So we have, like, what, 44? We have 18 out of 44 is our chance to draw a land. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes! Thank you, Jesus Christ. Oh, baby. Alright, and we have the Carrion Feeder, which can help beat a uh, Worm Coil Engine. Man, that was such good. Like, that was the last turn for us to, like, win still. Like, still win the game. That was it. <clears throat> so now they need to hit the, um,. But oh, they might not even have it. But now they need to hit uh, the tower and the O-Stone. And then I can come back from... I can still beat an O-Stone. So they need Ugin, but I can beat Ugin because Carrion Feeder. They had to have, like, an end-step dismember. So basically, we win. Sweet. Fuck, that was so close! <laughs> Ooh, okay. Rub against Tron. What do we got? Alright, here we are. Tron. Tron, Tron. Against Tron on the play. Okay, we're on the draw. So you take out the basics, a chill, a sluice, a feeder, and a amalgam. So amalgam's too slow, a chill's a bit slow as well. Um, I like taking out feeder on the draw, but not too many. Um, I like taking out a swamp as well. So you bring in, this guy would bring in grudges, so I would just bring in four force negations. Leave it at that. Yeah. Um, oh, goes a bit too slow, I think. Uh, there's an argument for bringing in, oh, I could bring in astrophy. I could also bring in some number of nature's claims. Let me make sure. This deck doesn't even run nature's claims. Okay, yeah, yeah. Let's go back to where Tron is. There. All right. Um. We're going to check just in case. 
There's the Ash Trophy. I would take out another... I'd, I'd probably take out a Grave Crawler for a trophy. Um, bum, 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 bum. Where's my articles at? Look at how much content that I cast. This guy's fucking rocks. Damn. Tron. Go under. Alright, Force Nature, Thoughtseize. I do have a Thoughtseize, don't I? Damn it, I'm bad. You take out Supplier, Murpha, Grave Crawler, Malcolm Chill. Supplier. Merfolk. So you bring in all four forces and the Thoughtseize, and I have this Astro mm -hmm. as well. So what do I want to bring back in then? Probably the Seeker Keeper, because it knows more. Alright. There we go, we'll run it back. <coughs> Uh, this hand is pretty bad. It's a mold of four. This hand on the draw is almost as bad, except we can top back a land and pop off again. <sighs> Did they keep or mold? They mold and kept. Okay, so they're down to six and they've kept. I kind of do need to keep like really fast hands. Um... I have to hope I top like a land. I think I'll do that. Hope they don't have a Grafter's Cage. Tron does run Cage. They run two sometimes. And Relics. Cage and Relic. So I can't really beat a Cage. <clears throat> I'll probably go turn one feeder. <laughs> Excuse me. Alright, we got we got the force negation. That sucks. Well it suck well it's good, it's fine. You can pitch crab, I guess. Alright, so they have Tron on turn three. <clears throat> Come on, land. Great. I'm gonna play supplier. I'm gonna sacrifice supplier. In response to the trigger. I'm gonna sack. Cause I need to deal as much damage as I possibly can. Because I'm in like a like a really big race right now. <coughs> yeah. We'll probably pitch the crab. Yeah, because the crab's bad, because even if we top deck a land, we need to play the crab after pl using the land. But they grabbed a force. They already had Tron. Those sons of bitches. This son of a bitch already had natural... Well, not natural, but had the Tron land he needed. Plays the forest anyways. Didn't have the Tron land. What? I'm confused. Maybe he's looking for a cage, so I'm gonna keep force negation for a cage or a relic. I'm really confused right now as to why our opponent didn't just grab the Tron land and they played a forest instead. I, I don't understand. Maybe this isn't like regular mono green Tron. <sighs> it could be a like once upon a time it'll draw Tron. Uh, yeah, no, I don't. I'm confused. I don't actually know. Whatever. We'll see what happens. <clears throat> we have force negation to paper over any mistakes or any uh, force negation is like our ace in the hole I think is the phrase <clears throat> I have six damage on board so this is a three turn clock come on just give me a land though that'd be nice plus I've only milled two lands so I have what, three, so 16 left in the deck. There's a worm coil, okay. Well, that's really bad for us. Good thing we have feeder. Wow. Worst possible land. Um, okay. On their draw step, I'm going to Ash Trophy. They're 
because that's what they fetched, right? No, they didn't fetch anything. They just had it. Okay, I'm just going to have to... I'm going to ask Trophy under draw step. <coughs> this also plays round force uh, of, sorry, Vela Summer. Yes. Float of mana. Alright. <coughs> Yeah. Yeah, that's not happening. Sweet. So I can do plus three damage. So that's six, seven, eight, nine, they're down to two. I'm gonna do that because. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Gotta cast it first. Five, eight, bring them down to three. Yeah, this beats them like playing the worm coil next turn. <clears throat> Force negation, good card. Yeah, so I can beat a worm coil now. They need to. I don't know what they need. Uh, probably a bridge. They need to go like Tron Land into Karn into Bridge. And then I can uh, glimpse myself and try to hit a creeping shell in my top 10 cards. So we might, we, I think we have this. I think we have this. I thank you, one of Ash Trophy. Thank you. I love you. You're beautiful. You're gorgeous. Seb McKinnon, your art is amazing. I love you, Seb McKinnon. Thank you, Ash Trophy. You're the best. There's a Karn. There, what? They just fucking had it. God damn it. What the fuck? Well, there's a one Carl engine. Gonna fetch here. <laughs> All right, that was that was fast. So we're three to one. We got uh, three more rounds, seven total. We just beat Tron two zero. Oh. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, so Tron is the reason, like the biggest reason we're running carry and feeder. Just Tron with warm coil engine is why we're running feeder. So that was nice. That was good. Fun day. Good times. Yeah, it looks like our opponent was hoping we wouldn't know about the carrying feeder interaction. Because they probably should have gone, like, Karn into Bridge instead. Um, but yeah, that was good. All right. I will end it here, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching so far.